down while we're talking about Stratford. It can actually be a very tough job getting children interested in Shakespeare, and that's in English, isn't it? Uh, but one inner city school in Birmingham has succeeded thanks to the enthusiasm of a former pupil who just happens to be a famous actor. Yes, it's David Harewood who is starring in the TV series Homeland, and he had just five days to coach the students. Then it was onto the stage in Stratford. Bob Hockenhold reports. Actor David Harewood's career has taken him to Hollywood, but he's never forgotten his roots, so jumped at the chance to mentor pupils at his former school in Washwood Heath in Birmingham. The challenge to turn them into Shakespearean actors in five days. It's going to be a challenge because I don't like doing things in half measures. I want to, if I'm going to do it, I want to do it really well. So if you can, if you can infuse them to do Shakespeare and if they fall in love with the language and if they're able to perform it, I think they'll get more out of it if they really put something into it. So I really want to make sure that they uh, put a lot of effort into it. David admits he was a bit unruly in class until a teacher cast him in a play and gave him direction. Hello. After being introduced to the pupils, Hello. he sets about testing Hi. their acting abilities for a performance of Macbeth. Hello, and today I'm here to sell this hat. Thank you. Two buildings lost. Father lost. That's it. One. I reckon there's eight. Well, there are eight parts, but I reckon there's at least ten kids that I'd like to get involved. In X Factor style, the chosen actors are announced by David. Melissa. <laughs> awake, awake, ring the alarm bell. Awake. And for those who are picked, a chance to perform on the stage at Stratford in front of friends and family. An experience David hopes will leave a lasting impression on these youngsters. Bob Hockenall, BBC Midlands today. Sure he has. Well, you can see that documentary in full on Sunday at 10.25 on BBC One. Yes, well worth a watch. It's very moving. Now, Dan is here.